What's going on, everyone? Chris from PickDogs.com here with your free pick in the Miami Marlins versus New York Mets Major League Baseball matchup going down Saturday, May 18th, 2024. Just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, the games that I love, including my daily $19 best bet, make sure that you head on over to PickDogs.com and click the Premium Picks tab at the top of the page. Also, make sure you check out my 2024 Major League Baseball Grand Slam Season Pass this is for those betters that are betting $1,000 or more per game on Major League Baseball this season. But what that Grand Slam season pass is going to get you is the waiting and rating of my plays for the first time. You're going to know where my biggest bets on the board are. It's also going to get you, excuse me, get you access to my Nerfies and Nerfies and my first five plays. My first five plays have been absolute money, as well as plays that I make throughout the day based on things like line moves, money moves, pitching changes, and lineup changes. We've had back-to-back -back winning days with the Grand Slam season pass. Looking to keep it rolling into the weekend. So if that sounds like something you're interested in, that's the kind of bankroll that you're working with, text 775-636-7674. We'll get you some more information. But let's get to this one between the Miami Marlins and the New York Mets. The Miami Marlins sending out Braxton Garrett to the mound in this one, while the New York Mets will counter with Luis Severino. And uh, Garrett, you know, didn't have the return to the Marlins rotation that he definitely wanted. You know, five runs allowed on five hits over five and a third innings of work. Um, eight strikeouts. Did give up a home run in that start as well. But, um, you know, it was just a rough spot for him to be in against a Phillies lineup that, you know, just has been hitting the ball, you know, with conviction. and been absolutely crushing teams as of late, crushing opposing starting pitching. But now, you know, Garrett gets a decent matchup here against the New York Mets team. It's back to being inconsistent. They have a losing record against teams starting lefties this season. You know, um, a, a losing record within the division. But not only that, the New York Mets in the month of May have been the worst team in baseball against left-handed pitching. You look at their numbers, batting average against lefties, they're dead last in baseball. You know, team OPS numbers, dead last. Isolated power numbers have been brutal as well. So it just makes it extremely hard to get behind the New York Mets when this team can't hit themselves out of a wet paper bag against left-handed pitching. You know, the Miami Marlins haven't been great in their own right. And Luis Severino, you know, he's been up and down this season for sure. But he's been a lot better at City Field. You know, you look at all the, the recent success that he's had. Four of his last six starts, he's given up two runs or less over five-plus innings. The problem is all four of those starts where he's given up two or two runs or less have come at home. In his two road starts, he's given up a combined seven runs on nine hits, 11 strikeouts to six walks. The six walks all coming in one start against Tampa Bay Rays over five innings of work. Gave up those seven runs on a combined 11 innings of work. So I just don't, I don't trust Luis Severino. You know, the, the, the Marlins have actually been a lot better against righties than they've been against lefties this season. You look at the Marlins against lefties. The Marlins against games started by left hand and pitching are 1-15, you know, when when their opponent starts a lefty. So 12-17 and 17 against righties entering uh, entering Friday's action. I just think the Miami Marlins are just in a much better spot here to be able to pick up the W. The Mets, like I said, this Mets team is struggling against lefties, and I don't, I don't expect that to change here. I'm going to take the Miami Marlins in this one, and that's going to be my free pick. But just a reminder, if you haven't already, make sure you're subscribed to our channel and smash that thumbs up. And if you're looking for my best bets, you can find those at Pick Dogs Premium. While you're Pick Dogs, check out our betting tools. They're 100% free. They're the best betting tools in the business and tools that you want to make sure that you have in your back pocket when you're making your best bets for the day's action. And while you're at our YouTube channel, make sure you have notifications turned on so you can be the first to be in the know when the newest content drops here. Pick Dogs. Thanks for watching. See you guys soon.